has it affected your job? Were you able to continue working? I have been able to continue working. I am fortunate in working for a large employer where, for example, reaching targets for employing disabled staff are met, so I can tick a box. It has been a slight challenge, slight behavioural problems for me, in the sense, for example, in my case, because of where it is in my brain, it's affected um, some of my risk-taking and uh, disinhibition, as I call it, so, and also my tolerance thresholds. I did ask my staff a few months after my seizure, I said, tell me in confidence what you've noticed about changes in my behaviour. And the consensus that came back was that I wasn't quite as tolerant of people as I was in the past. And before, I've been much more patient and understanding and tolerant. I hadn't noticed it, but they, put, they, they pointed this out to me. And it was quite useful. My assistant at the time, she was very good at watching out the triggers for me. So when I would have a red miss moment, she was saying, Frank, pass me the phone, or Frank, calm and tranquil. I don't have her support now, I don't, as I've actually put on the wall of my office the sign, calm and tranquil, which is a, a reminder to me. And I've learned to recognise triggers which can make me go into misbehaviour mode. So it's behavioural stuff in my case. So in my job, I've had to explain to colleagues and to managers that I do have these slight problems and I do try hard to control them and to manage them so I can carry on working effectively and I hope I'm still empathetic and sympathetic and supportive to my staff and that they understand that I'm doing the best in the circumstances.